Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how you can reveal the library folder in your home directory. So in previous versions of Mac OS X, if you went into your home directory with your little house icon, you'd see a library folder. There's a lot of stuff in this folder, I use it all the time, and I'm sure a lot of other people do too, specifically more advanced users. And in Mac OS X Lion, the folder's still there, but it's hidden and you can't access it normally. And that's because Apple feels that it's not really necessary for most users, which it really isn't. But I like to have it there and I use it. But there's a handy way that you can re-enable this in Lime. The first thing you can do is, if you only use the folder occasionally, it might be easier just to go up to the Go menu and click on Go to Folder. And in here you can see I already have the path entered, and that is the little squiggly thing, which is the tilde, then slash library, slash. And then if you hit go, it'll go to that folder, and you can access it. But as soon as you close this window, that'll be gone. So what you'll probably want to do is go into terminal, and I'll show you what to do. So I'm going to go up to spotlight, and I already have terminal typed in. So if I hit terminal, and open up terminal here, what I'm going to type in now is just one simple string of text, and I'm going to do type in ch flags space no hidden space and then the tilde slash library. And I'm going to hit enter. Nothing visually is going to happen. You're not going to see anything change. Uh, but once you quit terminal, go back into your finder and then click on your home directory again. You're going to see that there is a library folder there. And from there, you might want to, you know, add it to your sidebar, something like that, uh, or whatever. And uh, you can see that it's all there. And you can access it whenever you want. And I find this very handy, and I'm guessing a lot of you will too. I think it was a little bit of a bad move on Apple's part to disable it, uh, but I can see their point in it. Now, the other thing you can do is, if you want to disable it again for some reason, if you go back into terminal and you type in almost the exact same thing, which is ch flags and then hidden and then tilde slash library and hit enter and you go back into finder, you're going to see that the library folder is hidden once again. Now you can do this with any folder, so if I type in ch flags hidden and then tilde slash desktop you can see that when I go into my home directory, the desktop folder is hidden. Now, I wouldn't recommend that at all, uh, but you know, it's an option. And then once again, to unhide it, you just had to add the no in front of hidden. And that's all there is to it, and that's how you re-enable the library folder in Mac OS X Lion. And the other thing I'm probably going to get questions about is my status bar down here. Um, in Lion, that's disabled by default. You can't see how many gigabytes you have on your drive. But if you go up to the view menu and you click on hide status bar or show status bar, in this case it's already there, so I'm going to hit hide, it'll go away and come back as you wish. So I hope you found this video useful. And as always, if you have any how-tos that you'd like to see me do, make sure to send me an email and I will do those as soon as I can. So I hope you found this video useful and thank you for watching.